Ever felt like your personal information is out there, floating in the digital ether, beyond your control? Maybe you've had enough of those pesky credit card offers, or just want to take back your data privacy. Well, you're not alone. Today, we're diving deep into how to delete your Experian account, a crucial step towards reclaiming your online identity. Let's be real, dealing with credit bureaus can feel like navigating a labyrinth. But don't worry, I'm here to guide you through this maze. We'll break down the process step by step, so by the end of this video, you'll be well equipped to say goodbye to Experian. First things first, why would you even want to delete your Experian account? Good question. While Experian plays a vital role in the credit system, it also holds a wealth of your personal information. From your address history to financial details, it's a goldmine for identity thieves if it falls into the wrong hands. By deleting your account, you're taking proactive steps to protect yourself. Now, let's get to the nitty-gritty. There are essentially three ways to delete your Experian account. Online, by phone, or by post. We'll explore each method, highlighting the pros and cons of each. Online deletion. Sounds easy, right? Well, it can be. But it's important to know what to expect. We'll walk you through the steps, from logging into your account to finding the right settings. I'll also show you exactly where to click to initiate the deletion process. Keep in mind, this method might not be available for everyone, so we'll discuss potential roadblocks. Phone deletion. Sometimes, picking up the phone is the most efficient way to get things done. We'll provide you with Experian's customer service number and walk you through the process of explaining your request. It's crucial to have all your details ready, so I'll give you a checklist of information you'll need to have on hand. Postal deletion. Old school, but effective. If you prefer the written word, We'll give you the address you need to send your deletion request. We'll also provide a template letter you can customize to make the process as smooth as possible. Remember, this method might take longer than the other two, so be patient. Once you've successfully deleted your Experian account, it's essential to take additional steps to protect your privacy. We'll briefly touch on some extra measures you can implement, such as freezing your credit report and monitoring your financial accounts closely. Now, a word of caution. Deleting your Experian account might have consequences. For instance, it could affect your ability to get credit in the future. So, it's crucial to weigh the pros and cons before making a decision. With that said, thanks for watching and until next time.